Andrew Mullen. Thank you, Jack and Mary. That was wonderful. I, three things uh, come to mind when I think about Sue Banger. One, she knew how to have fun. <laughs> Two, she was awfully tough. And three, she cared very deeply about people. I only had the privilege of serving with Sue and the citizens of Wyzetta for a year. But in fact, I really had a much more personal relationship with both her and her family. For at our house, uh, Sue Banger was not council member of Sue Banger. It was Aunt Susie. <laughs> Always Aunt Susie. Uh, the Tenor family has been connected to my wife's family for nearly 60 years, and I only plugged in in the last 15. So as I had a chance to reflect today on what impact Sue had on me, it kind of dawned on me that she had trained me in for this role, <laughs> my current role in council, that is. Um, as some of you know, I'm relatively new to this role, and uh, instead of following the traditional path of service on planning commission and then the council, not me, I, I, I chose to start here, but, but I had uh, Susie. My training for this job uh, was her, and it was a lot more interesting than planning commission, I must say. Because <laughs> uh, Susie and I got to caucus at Park Street, and up north at Lake Margaret, and Gull Lake, and usually there'd be a few libations and a few discussions, sometimes heated, going all the way back to the late 90s. So 10 years of the best training I could ever get. Ton more uh, than I got here on the job, I must say, guys, sorry. <laughs> <clears throat> she really set a great example, and uh, whenever we were talking through the issues of the day, it was very clear to me how thoroughly she researched things, how she picked a path, and even in a disagreement, she had a wonderful way of engaging you, always with a smile and always a laugh. You know, she had fun with it, that's a great example. She was tough. She fought this past year in ways with courage and toughness that is unmatched. Always with a smile and always with a laugh, and she had fun with it. And the com commitment to the citizens of Wyzetta during this time never wavered. She loved being around people. She had a particular interest in the generation below her. Any friend of her daughters, Bridget and Sarah, that are here tonight know what I'm talking about. She got energy from people, and she gave it back. And she loved her kids' contemporaries. And I, I really mean that. She saw good in everyone. So uh, to the Bangerts, the Tenors, the Fitzgeralds, the Guillaumes, the Randolphs, the Lackeys, and my good friend Andy, we'll miss you. <laughs>